We are with Kelly, dental hygienist at Dr. Voss and Mommy. Why are the primary teeth commonly referred to as baby teeth important? Because they will aid children in chewing as they begin to eat food. They hold space for our permanent teeth to come in at a later age. And they also aid in the development and growth of our muscles and jaw. At what age do the, these teeth start to come in? Usually around six months of age, but some children get them a little sooner and some children get them way later. When you see a pediatric dentist, he usually palpates for those teeth buds to make sure that the teeth are developing down in the bone properly. At what age do these teeth start to fall out? Usually around six, but again, it can happen way earlier than six, and it can happen a lot later than six. And typically, it sort of follows the pattern of when you got your first baby tooth. So if you were early getting your baby teeth, you'll probably be early getting your permanent teeth. And if you were late getting your baby teeth, you'll probably be late getting your permanent teeth. Why do we have to take care of these teeth if they are just going to fall out? Well, if a primary or a baby tooth gets decay in it, it can cause an infection and pain for a child. So it's important for our health that we don't allow that process to happen. But if it does, it's important that we restore or keep these teeth because, again, they are holding space for our permanent teeth. And losing teeth younger than we should can lead to problems with spacing and crowding issues later on where we need to involve an orthodontist to help us. How can viewers learn more about Dr. Voss and stay up to date on the latest? They can visit our website or they can follow us on Facebook. Thank you for your time today. You're welcome. This is Annabelle Buck reporting for the Mommy Digital Media Club.